Now, you went back to WCW, I believe, and you were part of the stud stable with uh, Robert Fuller. Mm -hmm. And you had some uh, matches. I guess you actually worked with Terry Funk, and you had a series of matches with uh, Dustin Mm Erdman again. Yeah. What was that? That was great. To wrestle wrestle Terry Funk in a non-ECW environment was great because he was one of the greatest of all time and a legend. And for, you know, like I said, again, I keep referring back to, to guys my age that understand the business. I mean, that's an honor. It's like being out there with Harley Race, I mean, or the guys of that nature. Jack Briscoe, whoever they are, Ric Flair, Dusty, all those guys. Uh, it's an honor to be out there with them. Uh, Bunkhouse Bunk, a lot of guys don't know, is a great wrestler. I mean, he was cast into a one-dimensional role. These guys like him and Robert Fuller and all those guys, I mean, they've been around forever. They're great performers. Um, Terry Funk and those guys with Robert Fuller talking for him was, was a pretty good tandem. But the cowboy thing has been done to death. Right. Nobody cared. Um, if there was a scenario that they could have been recast in, I think it would have been great. Um, so I enjoyed the time being with old school guys that knew what they were doing. But, again, I was miscast too, I think.